Mr. Mayor, in the event of a car accident in Kansas City, Missouri, or Kansas City, Kansas, can Mayor and Rosenberg assist somebody that's been involved in a car accident? Absolutely. My, I and Mr. Rosenberg and Mr. Garrett are all licensed in both the states of Missouri and Kansas. So we, we are Kansas attorneys as well as Missouri attorneys and you know, operate on both sides of the state line. So we're fully able to pursue claims. We, you know, we can pursue claims in other states, but you know, obviously what we're focused on is the metro area. And you know, there are different laws. Kansas has different laws and different statutes of limitation. Kansas is a two-year, Missouri is a five-year. So there's things, you, differences that you have to be aware of. Uh, but certainly we in, we're involved in both states. Kansas is a no-fault state, uh, which means that, that there's 45, at least $4,500 uh, from, from your own insurance company to pay for your medical care. I had a client uh, come to me yesterday who had an accident, was a Kansas resident and, and had a Kansas accident and hurt herself and she was afraid to go to the hospital because she was concerned about the, incurring a bill because she wasn't otherwise insured. She didn't have health insurance. Uh, I mean, the good thing about the Kansas insurance policies is that, that you do have th that at least $4,500 available for your immediate medical needs. Uh, and if you're in a Kansas, if, you're, if you have a Kansas policy and you're involved in a Missouri accident, you still have that $4,500. So if you, whatever state you're in, uh, obviously the most likely is if you live, in, live on the Kansas side and you're driving in the, on, in the Missouri and have an accident, you still have that PIP available as personal injury protection money available, which, which covers not only uh, the, the medical bills, but will provide up to $900 for loss of income. So yes, we handle cases on both sides, Missouri and Kansas. If it's all right with you, I would like to expand upon what you just covered. What if I'm a Missouri resident and, and a Missouri vehicle with my auto insurance being Missouri based and I'm driving in Kansas and I'm involved in an accident that wasn't my fault? Do, because the accident happened in Kansas, would I still have, does, is my insurance policy obligated to give me that $4,500 medical because the accident happened in Kansas? Yes. And, okay. and, and fault is not an issue. That's why what, what they, when they call Kansas as a no-fault state, and what that means really is that um, fault is, it doesn't matter who's at fault in the accident, the, the first $4,500 of your own insurance is primary for your medical care. And, and if you have, if, you know, it's obviously it's easy to drive uh, into other states. And the way the laws of, of every state is written and the laws of insurance, and the, and the way insurance policies are written, they're written so that they conform to the laws of any state in which the car can be driven. Okay. So uh, there are some states, uh, there used to be, I'm, you know, some of the southern states had liability limits of $10,000. Well, Kansas and Missouri both, the, the minimum policy coverage is 25. But if, so if someone drove one of those, from one of those states where they had a $10,000 limit, if they drove into Kansas or Missouri and had an accident, they would, they would have $25,000 limit because the law says that the insurance policy has to conform to the laws of the state in which you, the accident occurs. So, you, so to an, go back to your question, of if, you had a, if you were a Missouri registered driver with a Missouri registered insured vehicle that had an accident in Kansas, because the accident occurred in Kansas, the Missouri policy is required to conform to the laws of Kansas and provide that $4,500. And because this is so f confusing, and, and again, I just learned this would be the exact reason that you and Mr. Rosenberg invite phone calls. Absolutely. To clear up that confusion. Because I, I just learned, I mean, I just learned it, this would be very important. And then my insurance guy, because I'm Missouri based and because my vehicle is in Missouri and his job is to get the claim as cheap as possible, he might not be so forthcoming about the automatic $4,500 that I'm supposed to receive for the medical benefits especially if the first question he was to ask me was, well, Wes, I understand you were just in, are you okay? 
as soon as I say I'm okay, I'm sure it probably puts that medical money in some type of a jeopardy. Potentially. Potentially. Because he could say, well, he said he was all right. It, Obviously, you know, you're right. That's, that's back to what I said about being careful what you say. You know, the fact that you, you may say you're okay to the police officer or you may say you're okay to, to the EMTs if they show up, uh, what you need, it, but, you know, it doesn't necessarily mean that, you, that, that there isn't some injury that you're unaware of or that, or that you're not feeling because of the adrenaline rush at the time. Okay. You know, Kansas, the, 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 the PIP money, the, the, the no-fault PIP money available in Kansas is subject to, you know, some standard of medical need. So there has to be some doctor that says, yeah, it was, th th it's, it was necessary, the treatment was necessary, and it was reasonable. Um, you know, that, so obviously emergency treatment and evaluation is, is certainly a reasonable step to follow following some kind of traumatic accident. Now, I would like to, I'd like to inject, based on the conversation that I had last week, Mayor and Rosenberg has aligned itself with providers, healthcare providers, medical doctors and chiropractors that work with you and you work with them to determine whether, because you had just said, well, it's based on if a doctor says that, yes, this treatment's necessary. Because of, because of the way that you guys like to help people, you have, you've created a group of practitioners that believe in a person's recovery a recovery. I like the way that Dr. Fox explained it. He said, Wesley, he says, I believe in a, reco a pain recovery program so that people can get their life back. And that's what inspired me about Marin Rosenberg the most is that you guys are not just attorneys and lawyers. You're, you're people who care and you have a team of people who care. In the event of a, somebody finds out that they're in the car accident and they've been hurt, um, my understanding is that you have a series of providers that, like a network of people that you work with, doctors and chiropractors and everything, um, to help, for helping people. Could, could you expand upon that a little bit? Well, you know, uh, we don't know what, uh, what's the, what the result of Obamacare is going to be, but obviously there are a lot of uninsured people out there. Yes. And, you know, when they're involved in a car accident, the uninsured, I mean, they, they don't have access, regular access to health care. Um, and, and, and sometimes, um, you know, they're, they're reluctant to pursue that because they're worried about incurring a debt or ending up with, a, you know, some kind of a debt. Yeah. You know, we would, and it, that's, the, that's the, I think, a real primary reason why people should call. If they're in an accident and they have questions, they need, they need answers and they need to know how they can get access to to competent health care uh, yeah we, we have been fortunate to establish relationships with medical providers chiropractic providers you know we've got anesthesiologists uh, orthopedic surgeons who are willing to you know see our clients on an as-needed basis so you know call people should give us a call because uh, there may be there, there may be injuries out there that, that aren't getting addressed, and uh, you know the sooner they're addressed, the better off everybody will be. The better, you know, you'll heal more quickly, you have a better chance of recovery, and you know your claim will will be cleaner uh, and, and more cogent to present to the insurance company. So yeah, it's important, and and, and yeah, we are fortunate to have a group of doctors who are willing to, you know, provide that essential care. Excellent. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Mm -hmm.